the game didn't freeze, I accidentally, what you call it, press one of the, I think it was zero to get all the UI disappeared. Okay, reach the warehouse. Yeah, it seems that's the only one that we need directions for. The rest, probably, like, it'll be active in the, even though it's not highlighted. Oh man, you missed. You only have a second for each shot and you missed through that one. One day we're gonna be brave enough and take another a route that does not have oh my god come on does not have maybe today is the day well what say maybe one day I'm gonna be brave enough to go off road as long as you give me flat land I'll be fine this does not look like flat land I don't know why I pick ammo capacity, even though ammo capacity is already good. Oh no! The worst possible way for me to go to pick. Oh shit, I should have stuck with the road, huh? Engine power, what we need. Come on, bad boy. Okay, let's go back to the road. Don't. Oh. Okay, not bad landing. I'm annoyed at the fact that even though I pick a different route, we end up still on the road, the same road that we <laughs> that we would have been in a better spot had we just stick with it, stuck with it. Yeah, bring up our health. The incline does not give me confidence. I know it's gonna go way uphill after that. I have a feeling, not that I do. Stick to the basics. Don't be greedy, don't be hasty. We were at 29. Oh, plenty of stuff to pick up actually, but the terrain looks rather iffy. One day we're gonna have, and one day I'm gonna try attach a snorkel and then just drive through the river. If having a snorkel is enough for that. Shell more. Oh that's a big boy right there. And he's in the middle of the pathway. I definitely don't wanna be touched by it. For fear that it may one hit kill me. Either we didn't cause a single damage to it or our tractor has not been firing at it. You know what I think we have to because that route seems to be leading elsewhere. Just to hoping that this will lead us to the right way. Oh my god, I thought that guy was shooting, what you call it? Fire, oh no! I thought we could drive through that. Uh, I'm thinking, do we reverse? Oh shit, oh my god. We got lured into a... We got lured into a trap. 
That's an L for us and a W for them. Dang it. I'm actually disappointed that we didn't get to complete that quest. At least I think we didn't get to. Even though we were close to it. 2 11 there. All we have to do is. All we have to do is go back to that area there. Now that we know what eleven there is, might be doable. Okay, one, two, three. Powerful engine. Radio. Radio locator. Let's see, we don't know what the objective antenna. Ob what objects the antennas detect. But gradually, you will be able to remember which objects correspond to which radio signature and also what can be found near them. Custom markers on my own. Maybe this might be the answer to my question. Of how do we explore more of that? I like to think so. Output engine. Time. Extendable supports. Now you have my curiosity a little bit. Okay, let's try to do this in hopes that it will give us the result that we want that we were asking for i've never seen this but apparently i think we have it there you go We need three Swiss Army knife like thing. Oh, no problems. We got four of them. Yeah, the planet one. The planet is a rare one. Oh, apparently not. So you got like leftovers from that. Mm. I want to use all three of this. Or spread out. Hmm. Only one one. All or one. I think we can sacrifice this since we can manufacture it ourselves. Yeah, that's a good idea. Do I want to... Don't think too much, maybe? Shy above, say, just do it. Which is actually a good advice. How many years later, then we only realize he was actually giving a sound, useful advice. Alright, large antenna. Enhanced radar will allow us not only to reveal map over large radius, but also to improve interaction with it in the garage. Now you can place markers on the map for detailed instructions. Please visit the map section. Oh ho ho! It is what we wanted. Now you can place markers on the map that will be visible during the race. The markers can be moved manually or by reaching it on the map. Click left button to place a marker. Left click to remove it. Uh, actually, it's partially what we wanted. What I wanted is to explore this, but now we all can do is place markers at the black map. <laughs> okay. Maybe in the next exploration, we'll be able to do that. Let's equip all that we need to equip. Not sure whether we'll. I'm hoping this one will be enough for us to survive driving through the river, but. 
I don't feel that I'm not too sure whether will our weight pull us down to the river bed if that makes sense and we have to climb a, a big is it incline? a big incline to get out of the river and our engine power might not be strong enough for that oh, oh, oh. I don't know why I keep uh, I'm stocking up on this but yeah Mm. For now, let's not just extend the magazine. This is only the one, last one left. Okay. Double check. Sweet Lavender, Auto Run, City Ruins. So, City Ruins is what we're gonna have marked out on our map. Okay. Oh shit, it didn't mark out. Old city ruins. Where the heck is that? Maybe all the places that we drive drove by is considered old city ruins? Like this is considered maybe an old city ruin. Okay, I do my the route I'm gonna take is the same one we're gonna drive by the huge river where there's a lair. Not for sure there's a lair but possible of lair. Then we're gonna try to make our way into the big area where we managed to collect plenty of loot and encounter a mini boss or boss. Seems like a nice shot, but I'm not sure whether you killed anything. Oh man, we didn't manage to pick up the other one. Did you guys just see that flying thing spawn? <laughs> came from the right of the screen and immediately went to the left but oh I'm supposed to spawn here the lights teleport there again I've not been paying attention to this for some reason hell yeah me you Oh, apparently the rocket can <laughs> shoot through us. TIL. Which is good. So actually we don't have to worry about its rotation. I'm guessing the turret will be the same as well. Oh, did we go left or right? I somehow forgot. <laughs> I hope this is the right one. Okay, it is, thankfully. So far, okay, but twice, twice, we're not doing well. We have to encounter any alterants. Why aren't you shooting the one that's closest to you, buddy? Says the guy who chose auto aim. 
Why are they doing manual aim? Those two pop up on the left side were a little too late. They pop up earlier, I would, would have obviously drove towards them. Come on, shoot the biggest flying thing that's near to you. Oh man, we didn't pick up that one. Please tell me this is a city ruin. Is it just me or is this a new place? I think we drove to the wrong area. Hey! Did he one hit kill us or was our health that low? Holy shit. I should have drove to the red barrels, huh? I thought it might hurt us. Oh, I need to review that one. Like, whether is it one hit kill? God dang it, but that was anticlimactic and sudden. You were doing so well. Until then. In Snork Witch, uh, so uh, probably this one. It's so far still the same. Mono research items. Result engine production. Ah, oh, I think this might be useful. Took me this while to realize, but I think it might be useful. Let's see. What can we use for this? So you're the only one with the chemical thing. I believe. Unless we recycle stuff, maybe there might be one. Let's put you here. Okay, the drill. Mechanism's close enough. Oh my god, we don't have any. Shit, we have to recycle all those stuff. Me being me, even though they left, I like to recycle, but this one's... This one's different. Something I can refuse without being guilty. Okay, Swiss Army Knife Truck. Any more Swiss Army Knife? You. You. Probably both of you. Truck. You. Garage. Garage screen, boxes, map, screen. Two maps. Uh, maybe you, since we had two of you in the Oh, maybe one of each. Yeah. Here goes nothing. Okay, now it's some more utilities. Definitely useful, right? Sometimes we have to we have to install two powerful weapons on the vehicle to avoid overturning. You can install extendable supports. Oh okay. The recoil is for on the vehicle. I thought recoil like the weapon gonna recoil a bit, but apparently it's a whole thing. And extendable support, it's not what I thought it was. At least support for the vehicle, like to weigh it down inside my head. Like maybe I can like you know build a small, I don't know RC car, or small <laughs> turret that will be around me and help protect me for a certain amount of time. <laughs> I mean, my interpretation is different. Never, may, um, for sure not accurate, but it's like my head. That's what I thought it was. So where is this extra slots? 
Can't tell. Or maybe it's not for you. Could be you. And you. Or maybe it's a special slot. No. Seems familiar. You know what? Never mind. We'll realize it eventually. As for now, thank you guys for joining me for Ashes of Ruin. If you so much enjoyed the episode, don't forget to hit and like this episode. For more Ashes of Ruin, you can find it on the channel. In the description box below, we'll be linking to the Steam Store page. If this is up your wheels, you should definitely check it out. A very, say a very unique game. But it still has me hooked. Simple but yet different and engaging. Yeah, that's important. Simple enough for casual like me to understand and play. Engaging enough to keep me hooked and fun enough to give me an enjoyable time playing it. As for now, guys, take care and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.